Okay, hello and welcome guys. Today I am headed into Sam's. Let's see what kind of deals we can find in there. Look at this, right when you walk in, I don't know if this is a good deal, they got doorbuster treadmills, $600 from $7.99. Look at that, they got TVs here too, Seven, $800 from $900. This is a huge one, 86 inches. Gigantic. Seriously, gigantic. They got some really cute plants here for $19. I think I've talked about this before. This is the type of printer I have that I highly recommend and love. I don't know if this is the exact model, but it's this type with this kind of ink. And we bought it right when we first moved to Georgia. So we've had it for over two years now. And I have yet to buy ink for it. I still have a whole container of black because it came with two blacks. See, look, they have a cheaper version than these like $500 ones, $450 for $179. For and it's still like the same concept with this kind of eco, eco tanks. This my first camera is a doorbuster for $49.73. They also have this JBL speaker for $60 bucks from $100. That's a good deal. They got air tags four pack for eighty dollars. This is a good price, twenty bucks each. I used you might have seen my video, I used an air tag to track all our stuff moving across the country. And then I know people use them on luggage and things like that too. Look at these pretty decorations. I think this one's really cool. That would like take up my whole front yard. It would block everything. So I think this seems like this iridescent is like the new trend of the season. Is that what you guys are seeing? Let me know what you guys are seeing. And then they have these uh, rugs here, doormats. They look like they were like the hot item. Looks like that one was the one that everyone wanted. Oh, look at this balloon kit. Somebody in my family always puts balloons up and decorates. This would be perfect for her. These trees seem to be like the new trend. They look so plasticky, but I'm guessing it does not fall off and shed like the kinds that I have. And they have like these $300 nutcrackers here. These things are huge and cute, aren't they? I'll zoom out. And then last aisle of Christmas stuff for now. Oh, uh, Boards are kind of cute. I think that seems expensive though, $26. Oh, you get three of them for $26. Now I don't think that's expensive if you get three. Well, look at that oil and vinegar set. We got cookie decorating kits, Barbie, Harry Potter. I think my family, I hear them. And then we got some toys. I thought I heard my family, I guess not. They're probably, oh, there they are, down the toy aisle. Oh, look, Kinetic Sand. No, it's not. Yes, it is, Kinetic Sand's on clearance for $18.55. Oh, Bluey. Oh, I love this Poinsettia Legos kit. I think it's so cute. Look, this is on clearance for $10.65. This is on clearance for $15.82. This Legos Botanicals is really cute too. And then this is, I saw this advertised online, 100 bucks. My kids would love this set. This thing is $1,600 though. Do you remember when Gap used to be more expensive than $20 for our hoodie? Oh my gosh. 
These are really cute. Hello Kitty and Friends and the Care Bear set. Christmas sweatshirts. I could definitely see a lot of men wearing this Modelo one. Cars Light, Coca-Cola, we got a Ford. Cute, cute. They have Advent calendar puzzle sets, 24 puzzles for $12. They still have a lot left. And you know I like to tell you about my reading habits. I did read The Boyfriend right here recently. And I thought it was okay. Not the best, not the worst. I think I gave it like three stars. I do want to read The Housemaid. I know that there's a movie coming out for that. And then it starts with us. I hate that. Hate, hate, hate. Do not recommend. Uh, Icebreaker I read. I liked that. Oh my gosh, The Silent Patient. I've seen a lot of people talk about this. I was so surprised by it. So surprised. I misspoke. I mean, I still don't like Colleen Hoover, but It Starts With Us is a little bit better than It Ends With Us. I absolutely hate It Ends With Us. Hate it, hate it, hate it. Seven Husbands of Evelyn Hugo, one of my favorite books. Verity was a Colleen Hoover book, and I definitely think that was better than all of her other books. I think that's it here that I've read. I, I am so shocked. They have loft pajamas here too for 20 bucks. These are kind of soft. Wow. I don't know if you saw that, if I was dropping the camera or not. If you want matching Christmas pajamas, they have a ton here. And this looks like it's a good price. The kids are 13. I feel like you know at Target, the kids start at like way more. Maybe not. And here's the price for the adult sizes of these pajamas. This is a good price for kids who wear briefs. 381 girls briefs. It's a really good price. These 700 thread count sheets for 55 bucks definitely seemed like they were popular. I wouldn't have thought that, but it looks like it. I think I showed you some washable rugs at Costco and they were the washable brand. These are the members Mark brand, 100 bucks for a six by nine. I don't think that's a bad price for a six by nine that you can wash. This is a different look of a clock if I've ever seen one. Icy toner slippers, $10.98. I feel like that seems like a good price. Oh, look at these Nine West flats for $11.81. Okay, so I am in Georgia. We really don't need winter coats. I bought one first year I moved here. I don't think I've worn it once. But these I don't think are bad prices, $55, $35. Obviously they're not super heavy, but they might be, you know, enough for here. Oh, look at, here's some uh, Christmas sweatshirts. I think this is a good deal for a bathroom, 20 bucks. It's not long, but it's definitely plush. They have a ton of these kids jackets. My husband thinks I'm crazy for saying that word. I didn't see any women's, but this is a good price if your kids need them. They have these Carter footy pajamas, seven bucks. This is a good price, a hundred bucks for these knives. This is a good price if you need them. Those things are huge, two of them for 20 bucks. Huge. If you like these circle teas, they are circle drinks. There they are. They have these teas up here first, $9.79. I don't know how good this is, but General Tso's chicken with rice, 12 bucks. Looks pretty good. Look at this cute little tiny keg of Heineken. They're so cute. I think this looks new, chicken and waffle sandwich. 15 bucks and I think you get eight. $2 each. 
I got some complaints about these cinnamon rolls. Why do they have to have food dye in them? Red 40, why? Tell me why. It's a heartache. They have the fall pumpkin Starbucks flavors marked down to $27, $26.91. We get 60. Is that right? Where did I read 60? I don't know where I read 60. Maybe on the side. 64. They have these six packs of Barilla on sale for $7.01, but I'm sure Kroger has them uh, by five, and then they're 99 cents each. Four pack of bush beans, $6.71. Grilling beans. Have you tried this Dolly Parton's cornbread? It looks pretty good. I've not tried any of that Dolly stuff, have you? Ooh, uh, they haven't put these out yet, but they got these butcher's brine kits. I used to brine my turkey a la Elton Brown. Okay, so these biscuits are really good. It's eight fifty for four packages, so that makes it like two twelve a package. Is it worth it? Is it worth it? This is new Snickerdoodle popcorn. That sounds yummy. Ooh, have you had these apple cider donut cashews? Uh, I don't like cashews. Got some holiday fruit snacks. Ten seventy eight. They got little packages of fruit cake for ten sixty eight. Ooh, if you don't mind Sam's brand. I got 42 of these for $13.98. Do they have food dye in them? Yep, right there, look. Red 40. Panettone. Six bucks. Who wants a Christmas candy cane of Slim Jim? Maybe because I don't eat Doritos, I don't know about this, but Tangy Pickle in Cool Ranch? Seems like a weird combination. Holy cow, this is a bucket of Reese's. Prices of candy have really gone up. I think like last Easter was when I really noticed it. But I think it's like crazy insane now. Look at these Kit Kats. They finally made themed Kit Kats. How cute are these? Oh my gosh, they're so adorable. Aren't they? I can't be the only one who thinks that, right? Oh look, they got a uh, home gym. 325 bucks. They have little scooters here. For 20 bucks. And then some, ooh, BB games. Basketball. 100 bucks. Okay, so I am home from Sam's. This is my Sam's all. Let me share with what, you what we bought. Lorenzo got two pairs of pants. Hopefully they fit him and they'll be okay. This is what we got at the Frias. Then we got some bacon crumbles. Some cookies. I like these holiday cookies. Good to have on hand. Some eggs. Got some creamer. I ended up spending the uh, nine bucks on the heavy whipping cream because I plan on making some meals with uh, heavy whipping cream this week. Tomatoes. Goat cheese. We are totally out of goat cheese and I really like goat cheese on crackers or with uh, charcuterie boards. Some lettuce. We have been throwing away our bags of lettuce like the ones that are already made. So I figured maybe we would try to make our own lettuce salads. See if that works out for us better. Two bottles of sangria. Shrimp, I wanna make shrimp Alfredo this week. That's why we got the heavy whipping cream. That's why we got the shrimp. But they did not have any raw shrimp that did not have tails on it, which I thought was really weird. Two loaves of bread. Bananas, avocados. They did not have the White Claw that I have been buying that I like from there. So we settled on just like the original pack. And then we got these Kit Kats because they're so cute. Okay, that's everything we bought from Sam's this week. Hope you enjoyed my video. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe. Bye, everyone.